G'day, everyone. It's me, Lainey, and I'm back, and I'm talking. Isn't it great? Um, hopefully, next Minecraft video, I'll be able to talk and not have any technical difficulties. Um, as, you know, yikes. Um, just for some reason, I haven't been able to do much with audio things, because stuff and reasons and things in that. Very specific, I know, but... It's OC Sunday, and it's the one time of the week where I can talk about my characters, and nobody can tell me that I can't, because I can, they're my characters, through my YouTube channel, I do what I want. You know, as it, as it should be. <laughs> but, yes, yeah, so we've got two of my characters here today. We have Christina Wolfenden. Yes, they have last names, too. I never mention it, because they're dumb last names. Their first names are like, wow, Lenny, really? But the last names are just so basic and boring, it's like, don't even want to mention it. Anyway, Christina Wolfenden, Eminem, and then, you know, Mike Porter. You know, casual, boring names for people. But they don't have to have crazy names, which is not the, not the point at all. Anyway, this is them when they were in high school, which is when they first got together. And it was a very long and difficult road for them to get into a relationship. They were like the Jim and Pam of my character's world, which is always fun. But anyway, I met in while well, they were in high school, but they didn't meet in high school because Christina is a demon, and demons technically, technically, usually didn't mingle with the other students, especially not back in the day when there there were more, more, much more stricter laws for demons back when they were a bit younger. You know, as things go, you know, we love casual racism, except it's not against race. I mean, I mean it's a demons and not demons. You know, casual things that I did really want to be doing, but makes for a good story. <laughs> I don't like it, but it makes for good stories. Anyway, <laughs> racism aside, um, the demons <laughs> didn't really mingle with normal people, not for any real reason besides their demons. Some of them have magical powers that can cause significant harm, persuasion, death, and just general bad attitudes. But, you know, stereotypes. Am I right? I need to, I need to stop digging myself in a hole. Anyway, demons, they were in a demon class because there weren't very many of them that actually went to school. And then everyone else was in the other class. The demon class was run by a demon who was the only demon teacher in the entire school. She also taught art. Her name is Kathy. She's, uh, what I draw her every year as, you know, in the dinosaur thing. Ah, if you know anything about my art, you might know what I'm talking about. If not, ah, yikes. Um, and then, uh, she's, Kathy's dating June, you know, like the month, which is Mike's older brother who teaches science at the same school. Um, uh, not the point. You know, this isn't about Kathy and June, although I love them, they're pretty fun. Um, but no, it's about Christina and Mike, and we're almost, we're like halfway through with this video, and I haven't gotten to any point. This happens every time. I don't care. Anyway, met outside of school. Basically, Christina was running away from home because, you know, her mum is a little bit insane. Um, her mum is a witch, and her dad is a demon who doesn't actually love the mum, but because he's like a vampire, Vampire. He's not actually a vampire, but he like functions as a vampire and he drinks blood, but he's not actually a vampire. It's weird and complicated, okay? Not the point. But because witch blood is like super good, um, she's like madly in love with him and he's just like, eh, 
Um, but anyway, they've got three kids, so it can't be that bad. <laughs> Uh, awkward. This is just an awkward video about this really awkward family. Anyway, she was running away. Um, she was maybe 14, 15 at the time. Um, and she was like popping on roofs of houses and she slipped off a roof and banged into Mike's window. Um, and that's how they met. I know, right? And then they found out that they went to the same school, which is, you know, fun. Um, he was very concerned because he's generally a very shy dude, but he's kind of emo and he's got like piercings and his hair is not dyed. His parents are scientists and his brother is a science teacher and he's just a very sciencey dude altogether, but he doesn't, he's not as smart as them, so he kind of feels left out. Because, you know, he's an emo teen, as emo teens do. Anyway, that's how they met. <laughs> Long story short, she ran into his window. <laughs> and they and he was very shocked. Um, and she said, if you tell anyone I'm here, I'm going to bite you. <laughs> She's a very loud and happy, energetic person. Um, and he's not. But, you know, they're very cute, I think. But... That's, that's all we have time for today with this nonsensical video. Um, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Make sure you have a lovely day. Um, I will see you in the next video. Bye. Oh my god, this video is a mess, it's just nonsense.